So hello, my name is Alejandro Murillo and I'm an Applications Engineer with GSC. And today we're going to take a look at how to embed decals into our files. Typically when you add decals to your SOLIDWORKS models, uh, you create a reference. And if that decal file location changes or is deleted, uh, next time you open up the part, you will not be able to see the decal. So essentially you have uh, a broken reference. Now there is a way to add a decal to your model by embedding it. So let's run through an example and show you uh, this exact scenario. So here I have a grill assembly and I am going to add a decal. So the easiest way to do this is to go to Display Manager. And if I want to add a custom decal, I can right click and click Add Decal. And in this case, I'm going to browse for a decal for a decal that I have in my desktop. This is actually just a PNG file. And I am going to drop it on the top face of my grill. So I'll go ahead and select the top face. And you can see the decal was applied. Now I'll go ahead and save my model. And you can see under here in the, the appearance uh, or the display manager under view decals, you can see the decal that we just added. Now if I exit the model and I delete that image, because this image is being referenced and not actually embedded into the file, when I reopen the file, the decal will not, will not appear. And if I go and look at the current decals in my model, you'll see that I have a little X next to my GSC logo decal. And that's because it's broken. So how do we prevent this from happening? So a lot of times what we tell users is in order to prevent decals from disappearing, uh, because of broken references, you can go to Document Properties, and under Model Display, there's an option to store appearance decal and scene data and model file, and this will actually embed the decal file into your model so that it travels with it. So let's bring back my GSC logo. So I'm going to delete this broken reference and before I re-add it, I'm going to go to model display and check on that store appearance option. I'll select OK. So I'll hit OK. I'll go ahead and add my decal. I'm going to re-add that GSC logo. I'm going to apply it to only the face of my part, which is this top face. And I'll select OK. Here you can see that the part came in mirror, so I can always modify that. There we go. And then I'll go ahead and hit save.
Now, if I close this out and delete logo, just like I did before, this time when I reopen my grill assembly, logo should still appear because now it is embedded. So it travels with my model. If I actually open up the part file itself as well, because I applied it to the part, you'll see that the logo appears as well. So that's how you can embed logos into your part models or assembly models so that they travel with the model. This has been Alejandro with GSC. Thanks for watching.